Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do an exciting video and this is the next episode in the Shopping Out Stash series that I am doing with Paula from A Beauty Guru Made Me Do It here on YouTube and Instagram. So today we are going to shop our stash for Valentine pink shades. So we decided on this very beautiful baby pink shade and because it is shop my stash, I allowed myself to be a little bit more flexible about the shade. So more are more pinky and more some are more purple, but they're still in the baby pink category. We are going to do some swatching of my palettes and I'm really, really excited to show you guys what I found in my stash that was baby pink. So the first W7 palettes I I'm going to talk about is this small palette. It is called the Naughty Nine and it is in the shade Bangkok Nights and it is a purple palette, I believe. And I'm going to swatch this shade. It is looking very, very cream, kind of, but it is a baby pink and it has kind of a shimmer. So again, shut my stash, you don't have to be exact, but this is a baby pink. Yeah. So my shades are going to be matte, satin, like this shadow right here, and then shimmery and slash metallic, I think. The next W7 palette is this one. It is called Metal Pop, and this contains, it says soft metallic shimmers. You can take that as you want. I'm going to swatch that shade right there because, of course, it is a baby pink. And it is a little bit more lilac and it is very gritty so there's a lot of kind of fallout on my finger but it is this one and it's kind of duochrome as well the next two are kind of similar but they are from two different palettes these are the eye cushions i wouldn't say they are cream shadow but they are not powdery either i have not tried the color pop formula but i maybe think it is kind of the same thing so this is from Dreamer, the Dreamer palette. It has six shades and I'm going to swatch in that shade right there. And this palette is called Starlight and it is very easy to make dense in these cream shadows. So it is this shade. So this is a little bit brighter than the other one, but it is very, very similar. So these are the first four shades that I take as a baby pink. I should have made them smaller, shouldn't I? Um, let's take on my other hand, even though I'm not the greatest at swatching with my left hand. Oh my god, it is so busted. Can you see that? I'm so sad. Eyeshadow Symphony 3. And it is a limited edition from Holiday. It's a holiday release. And I'm going to swatch that one right there. And this is more of a champagne-y champagne pink. I could have done that one, but that is more purple. Now I took it on the wrong finger. Okay. <laughs> uh, a mess. Let's just say it like that. So it is this one. It is more champagne-y. It's not that pink, but... Um, I take it as a shop mustache thing. It's not perfect. Look at these shades, they're beautiful. <laughs> I'm so intrigued. It kind of looks like the one I have on my eyelid today. But that is not a baby pink shadow. I tried to do a kind of pinky valentine inspired and some hot jewelry and pink. I tried, okay? <laughs> Don't come for me. Then I have the Balm Nude 2 palette and I'm definitely going to be swatching a few shades. These two shades right here. They are called Stubborn and Standoff-ish. So Standoff-ish is definitely more of a goldy but it is and definitely more shimmery. So this is Stubborn and sorry and this is Stand off ish, I believe it's called, right? Then we have the MDK Gwen Stefani collab palette, and I'm going to swatch that one right there. This is the most pink in this palette. 
<laughs> There's so much fallout, um, if you know that palette. This is called Harajuku. It is a place in Japan and I have been there and I'm so excited to be seeing that. So, this is the shade. I have not used this a ton on my eyes and as I remember it's not very pigmented if you don't have a base. So yeah, this is definitely more pink. That was a horrible swatch. I'm so sorry. But again, as you can see, it's not as spread as it was on my finger. So it's definitely more baby pink when you apply it. Then we have my MDK Wise Fall palette. And I knew there was some pinks in this. And um, I'm not sure if you can call this a baby pink. But it's definitely more baby pink than that purpley pink shade there. So I'm going to swatch that shade right there. Which is called Fast Ball. It is this one right there. And it looks like it has some shift to it as well. Oh, let me see if I can. Yep. There you are. So this is a little bit warmer in the tone than the one from the Gwen Stefani palette. Just a different kind of baby pink, I believe. The next one I have is my Zodiac palette from BH Cosmetics. And there are some baby pinks in here. I think I'm going to swatch three. So I'm going to swatch the Shimmery from Leo and the Shimmery from Virgo. Virgo and the corresponding uh, baby pink matte shade right there. So these three right here. And these are buttery, they are smooth and they are beautiful. I have not tried them on my eyes yet, but I really want to make a palette bingo or something with this. So let me know if you want that. So this is Leo. Look at that. Look at that shade. That is so stunning. Then we have Virgo for the matte and the shimmer. So that is the matte. And then this is the shimmer. Look at those. They are so beautiful. I'm obsessed. I think that those are the most pinky shades from this palette and then they will turn kind of purple. I think I'm going to swatch one more and that is from the Blush Tribe Paulina palette. This is more purple but I wanted to show it anyway because it's beautiful and I have it even though it's a limited edition and you can't get it anymore. It is beautiful. I have this matte purple in a project right now. I have it kind of lightly in my outer corner today. But I want to swatch that purple shadow right there called Tinkling. Tingling? I don't know. That one. And as you can see, it's more purple, but I really wanted to show you guys anyway. Yeah, it's definitely more purple. So I could have chosen some other shades. Here, let me just do it here. Before I go overboard and too purple, I just want to end this video. So that is my shopping my stash for some Valentine baby pinks. Some are more champagne, some are more uh, a little bit darker pinks and some of them are definitely more purple. But I am so excited and some of them looks very champagne-y but I swear to you in person they are baby pink. Maybe baby pink is something else in Danish. I have no idea. But I'm so so excited about the shadows. And I definitely don't need any very light pink eyeshadow right now. I have enough. Let's just say it like that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please check out Paula if you haven't already. She is so cool you will love her if you don't already follow her but i'm sure you do i'm sure i'm sure you do <laughs> she's amazing and i love her and you should definitely check her out so if you like this video please give it a like subscribe down below if you want to see more videos like this or any other video and if you have any video ideas for me please let me know down in the comments and until my next video and the next video in this series i hope you are going to take care bye